Wixian designed Unit 79 neutralization and dioxan stripping requires only about 25 square meters of space. Organic acid, pure water, buffer and caustic soda will be neutralized in neutralization reactor 79MX1 and then go to stripping tower 79T1. Gas liquid separator 79F1 is used to remove the moisture with dioxan so as to prevent the material being carried over to the vacuum pump. Condensator 79 E1, condenses the water vapor containing dioxan, then discharge at the bottom. Under vacuum at 45 to 55 degrees Celsius, the neutralized material is evaporated, cooled, dioxan removed and degassed. At the bottom of the stripping tower, 791, 10 times capacity of SLES enters the neutralization reactor, 79MX1, through the SLES recirculation pump, 79P6. Therefore the reaction temperature rise is only 3 to 5 degrees Celsius, which is the key to obtain light color, and stable pH SLES. The neutralization reactor 79MX1 to stripping tower 79T1 to SLES recirculation pump, 79P6, constitutes the main process route of unit 79. Then finished product of SLES transferred to storage or packing via SLES transfer pump, 79P7. Water ring vacuum pump, 79P9, is applied to provide a vacuum condition for the system. Wixian designed unit 79, combines four functions dioxan and water removal, degassing and cooling, resulting in a short and simple process, or stable and easy to operate. The stripping tower is a static equipment, which is featured in less power consumption and maintenance requirements. Neutralization reaction is realized by neutralization reactor, 79MX1, which provides high shearing performance, in order to fully mix the materials. This system is able to produce SLES with low dioxan content at a wide range of SO3 concentration from 2.75% to 4%, free oil can be less than 1%. By achieving ultra-low dioxan content, low power consumption, and low organic raw material consumption, Unit 79 has become the leading technology in the industry.